Hi everyone! Why do I point like a gun when I'm waving? Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome to my channel. I just wanted to start this video off by saying I actually filmed this like three nights ago downstairs because I didn't want to carry all my stuff up here to my room. It turned out to be horrible quality, so I was like, there's no way I'm posting that. So I just carried it all up here today, and while I was setting my tripod up, I stepped on some glass. So I can actually say that I went through blood and tears to film this video. So with that being said, I really hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope you give it a thumbs up. It really means a lot to me when you guys do take the time to just hit the like button on my videos because it helps other people that aren't subscribed to my channel to see my videos and find my channel. Also, if you're new here and you're not subscribed, you should go ahead and click that subscribe button. I think when I'm filming this right now, we have about 900. So we're almost to 100. Math. Yes, math. Yeah, we're almost to a thousand, which means when we get to a thousand, I'm doing a giveaway. So go ahead and subscribe. And also, while you guys are here, before we start the video, I wanted to put my Instagram on the screen because I think it's a good way for you guys to keep up with me and my everyday life. I'm literally always on my phone. I'm always posting on Instagram stories or posts. So yeah, you should totally follow me on Instagram. And um, with all that being said, one more thing before I end the super long intro. I am moving back from an apartment to a dorm this year, so for those of you that follow me or were subscribed to me last summer, I did move into an apartment and now I'm moving back on campus because I wanted to live with Trisha, number one, and I wanted to move back on campus just because I, it's a long story. I just really I actually like living on campus better than I liked living across from campus, if that makes sense. It probably won't, but yeah. Anyways, let's get started with the dorm hall. Okay, this is pretty much guaranteed to be all over the place because I just have it all laying on my bed and around my bed, so it's not going to be in any order. Just whatever I grab is whatever I'm going to show you. I'm going to go ahead and start with probably the most boring thing because it's sitting right here in front of me. So I got this stepladder. I actually got this last year. didn't show it in my hall. I got it in my apartment for my closet so that I could reach the top of my closet. But I'm going to take it this year because I know that we'll be rising our beds and I want to have something to step onto because I'm really short and I can't just jump up on the beds once they're that tall. I probably won't keep that forever. I would like to get like a really cute step stool to get up on the bed, but that's going to have to do for now. guess I'll get into this big box of things. So first of all, this box, um, there's two of them. There's one inside of the other. I got these my freshman year. Also, I will link down below my freshman year and my sophomore year dorm tours because it's cool for you guys to see like how things change and what you bring every year to college as far as dorm stuff. So I'm going to take these boxes for now. I use them for storage and just random things like honestly all this stuff was in here when I brought it home from college and I haven't got it out yet. Probably going to end up getting some kind of different way to store things like maybe some tubs to push under my bed. But this is what I'm taking for now, and inside I just wanted to say wrinkle release, total, total lifesaver for college kids. Um, these are flight bags, you're probably going to need those. Uh, okay, I have this little mirror, I've took it since my freshman year. It's really helpful whenever we have a lot of people come over and get ready in our room, because not everybody's trying to get in all the mirrors. you got this one little one that someone can use. Hope I'm not talking too fast, I always do that. Um, I have some Tide Pods in here that are definitely handy for college students when it comes to doing laundry. And I have a candle warmer that I used in my apartment last year. We're definitely not allowed to have these or candles in our dorms, but I know me and Trisha, she's already bought a bunch of candles. And I'm going to take this too, and I have all kinds of candle warmers to put in there, little wax things. Moving on, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys these cute little decorations that I got at Walmart for like seven dollars for all these so when I filmed this the first time you guys couldn't see any of this so I'm hoping that you guys can see it this time this one says let's get lost and it's like gold suitcases and then there's like a gold heart I'll hold it close to the camera and maybe it'll focus and I don't know what this means I think it has something to do with travel but I'm not sure if you know what it means, comment down below and let me know. I like it. I think it's cute. Um, XOXO, that's just kind of basic. Uh, this one says, find joy in the journey. I think it's cute. Really pretty. Um, and then my favorite part is to travel is to live. And it's just a world map in gold. 
and you guys can see in the background here actually you might not can see but I have a world map on my wall it's like a big world map and I stick those little push pins in it every time I go somewhere new I showed you guys this in my freshman year dorm tour or dorm hall and I used it my sophomore year instead of my freshman year I'm going to show you again because I think it's really handy I got it from Bed Bath & Beyond I think it just hooks right here around the top of your closet just velcros and then there's all these boxes you can't really tell but it just hangs in your closet and it like saves you so much space as far as drawers go and in your closet you can put shoes you can put clothes you can fold stuff whatever I think it's really handy so I'm gonna take it back again this year and we'll probably end up using it I got this tapestry last year and I used it my sophomore year in my apartment but I didn't show it in my dorm hall so I'm gonna show it now I'm not gonna completely undo it there's like a sneak peek I'll insert a picture right here That's what it looked like in my apartment, so I'm just going to hang it up by my bed again this year. Um, I'm taking this little guy. It's just a little toothbrush holder. We're, we have, like, a bathroom in our room. It's shared between us and our other two suite mates. So we have, like, two sinks, a shower, a bathroom, like a toilet or whatever. haven't decided on all the decorations I'm taking for the walls yet. I usually just hang up like Christmas lights, like what's behind here, but white ones. Um, I have those from last year, so that's probably what I'm going to do again. And I usually put pictures on my wall but I have this little picture frame with just a picture from homecoming last year so I might take it I'm definitely gonna take this I got it for three dollars at Walmart the other day it's just a little pineapple that says welcome and it's so cute and then I'll probably take this because it's a picture frame and it has a little clip right here and I think it's really cute so I could sit it on like a desk or whatever and I might take this just to put on the wall taken it the past like three, two years to college I just think it's cute and what they're sitting in is this cute little brown wooden basket I used this last year for um, just like miscellaneous little things on my desk and I used this big one to put like binders and folders and notebooks and school books in and I just put it under my desk it saves a lot of room I don't know I might use it for the same thing again but I think we got these at like Oh, there's the sticker. We might have just got these at Walmart or somewhere like that, but yeah, really cute. A cute way to be organized. Go ahead and show you my bedspread, which is just, um, it's the jersey mater material, material, which I think is really soft, and it's just like this light gray color, and I'm not going to get it out of here because um, it's really big and I won't be able to get it back in here. But I'm going to insert a picture. The picture, the only picture that I can find online of it is not very good. Like, you can't really see it, but it's gray and it's got little ruffles on the sides. I ended up getting the full and the queen size instead of the twin XL because this is the only year that I'm going to have another twin XL. And I wanted to keep this because my bed is a queen. So if I ever want to switch it out of my own bed after college next year when I take my bed to, like, an apartment or a house or whatever I get... And I can. Can't find the sheets for it. I did get a twin XL on the sheets though, obviously, so they fit the bed. Oh, they're in here. So if you guys can see, it's just like a really light blue with like an odd little pattern. And they're called Super Soft Easy Care. I got them at Bed Bath and Beyond. Also got the bedspread at Bed Bath and Beyond. Oh, it's down there. It's pointing at the wall. But they're doing this thing now where you get 20 20 percent off. Uh, every purchase you make until like December of 2019 if you're a college student so if you need anything for college I would definitely go through Bath, Bed Bath & Beyond um okay I have this cute little pillow it's just gold and it's a bow and I'm gonna use it to decorate my bed that's navy and it's a pineapple and I used this last year I also used the other one last year I'm not you can tell a difference in like freshman year how much stuff you buy and then sophomore year I also, I, I bought a lot of stuff for sophomore year because I was going to an apartment instead of a dorm. But this year, going back to a dorm, I've, like, minimized everything. So, look, Trisha's bringing a futon and um, a microwave and a Keurig. And I'm going to bring a TV. And we're both going to bring, like, mini fridges and stuff. All that stuff, I think I showed in my freshman year. I'm not showing any of that this year. Like, it's just, you know, it looks like what it looks like. 
I wanted to show these. I showed them last year in my dorm hall, but I think they're handy. I usually show hangers. I know I showed hangers in the last two hauls that I did, but hangers are hangers. You know, if you prefer the felt hangers, get them. If you don't, don't. But you need hangers for college. But these are cute. I got it from Ross, and I got two of them. So you can hang four pairs of whatever on both, and I use it to hang my jeans up in my closet, which saves so much space. So, yeah, it's just like... And in here, I don't know what it is, but this is my trash can. Same one I used last year. It's the same kind that I used freshman year, just a different one. But this is the same exact one that I used my sophomore year. And I like it because it's not too little. You can fit whatever you need to in it, but it's not too big. It doesn't take up space. And then I got just a gray loofah from Bed Bath & Beyond also for the shower and of course I've got towels and washcloths and hand towels and all that stuff. You guys, I'm not going to show you that because I don't feel like going and getting it and literally you know what that looks like. Like I have gray and blue. My camera's about to die. I really hope it doesn't die because this is my second time filming this. But I'm almost done. So backpack. This is the same backpack. Oh, there's a pillow in here. I forgot to show you. Same backpack I used last year and it's the same color and kind that I used freshman year. But the Jansport is my favorite backpack for college. It's just what I've used the past two years, and it's done really good with me. So that's the backpack I'm taking. And this is another decorative pillow I'm showing you guys. So this side says Inspire. This side I could play with all day. It's just, but I'll probably leave it like on this color because it's prettier. Well, yeah, I think that's everything. So I hope you all enjoyed this found it helpful if you're starting college or you know if you just wanted to watch it um, okay but thank you all so much for watching like i said in the beginning of the video don't forget to subscribe don't forget to hit like also if you guys have any video requests that you want to see from me just drop those down in the comments below i'm happy to make anything that you guys want to see um, whether it's college related or not or whatever, I usually vlog a lot of my life and put it on here. So, yeah, just subscribe to keep up with me. Um, <laughs> guess this is the end. Yeah. Bye. I'll see you guys in the next video.